Hi, second graders. We are going to start our next project today. This is actually going to be for second and third grade. And I'm starting with a question here. What does peace mean to you? Now I'm going to pause the camera and I'd like you to talk with the people at your table about what peace means to you. But for our video, I'm just going to continue on. So that is our topic, peace. And what we are going to be making is a pinwheel. Now this is how our paper is going to end up looking like by the end of this video. We need to do some tracing and cutting. But let me show you how I get there. So everyone's going to start with a piece of paper. And I'm going to have one of these pinwheel tracers at each table. And just take that tracer hold it in place. You might have your neighbor hold it for you. And then we're just going to trace around the big square. And like that. Now I did make these little lines here. So you are going to trace a line here, here, And there, you should have four lines. So there it is. Pretty easy, right? Now after that, after you get to this, you're going to take a pair of scissors. And don't worry if the line hasn't, uh, you didn't fully draw the line. You can go over that. But I'm just going to carefully cut out the big square. I'm not going to cut anything else out today. This is how we start our pinwheel. The project is called Pinwheel for Peace. So that's why I started with that question. What does peace mean to you? We're going to be doing some decorating, but on the other side, we're also going to be doing some writing. Almost done. All right, scraps go out. There's my the start of my pinwheel. The first thing I want to do is put my name at the top. Mrs. Lawrence. And then you're going to come up to my table and I'm going to demonstrate how we begin to decorate our pinwheel, our pinwheel for peace. Okay, so I'll see you in a few minutes.